Hi there, I'm Abigail from Abby's Trust Cooking, and today I'm going to show you how to make chocolate fun. Come on, let me show you. So today we're going to have a little helper, and it's Georgina. Right? Hi. Say hi. Hi. And today you're going to help me make, make, help me make what? Uh huh. So right now we're making the caramel for the chocolate fun. We just have some white granulated sugar, and we're melting it over here on medium heat. We're just stirring it around and like stirring it up, putting the sugar on the edge so you can melt it. As you can see, it's starting to melt. We're also trying to break up the clumps. You want to help me, Sissy? Yeah. Okay. Here. Put it on the edge, remember. Okay. You might want to hold it. I'll hold it for you. Got it? Good job. You're so good. Okay. Try to break up the clumpies. Okay. Like this. We're going to want it. So it's nice and brown, because that's the color of caramel. Okay, here, let me do it. Okay. Melt it. So, choco flan is like a chocolate cake, and it also has caramel, like we're, you can see we're making right now. And it also has flan. Flan is kind of like a custard. So you're going to have the caramel. You're going to have the flan, and then you're going to have the cake at the bottom. And it looks really nice. And it's so good. Okay. So our camel's all done. So we're going to spray our pan lightly. I'm doing a mini bun. But you can do a normal one if that's what you have. So you take your camel. Nice and brown. You're going to pour it everywhere. Caramel. <laughs> okay. Once you poured your caramel in, you're gonna grab the top of this so you don't want to touch the bottom. You might get um burn your hand because it's really hot. And then we're gonna put a little layer of caramel everywhere. Okay, just like that. Okay. Get it everywhere. So, okay. So you've got that. You want to get your cake mix and your flan ready. Go so take a look at that. Okay. Now, come over here. We're going to mix our cake mix. Sissy, would you like to help me crack the egg and mix it yeah. up? Go ahead. Okay. Crack it on this counter. Okay. Crack it. Like that. <laughs> It's a strong egg. Here, crack it over the ball. Good job. Now throw it in the trash behind us. Thank you. Start mixing it for her. So we're here. We're doing chocolate cake mix. Uh, for the measurements, since it's a mini cake pan, we had to change the measurements a little bit. So we just did fractions and decimals. So we're doing chocolate cake mix. Uh, you can do any cake mix. You can do strawberry. Or anything you want, really. Or you can make your own cake from scratch, but we're just using the box cake. Here, you want to finish that up? Yeah. And here is the flan mix. It looks weird because we have vanilla <laughs> with the eggs. So there's two eggs, a splash of vanilla, half a can of condensed milk, and half a can of evaporated milk. Okay? You got that? Okay. Keep mixing while I do this, okay? Get this behind you. Sorry. Got it? Okay. Thank you. So we're going to start on low. And just we're going to mix it up until it's all combined. Okay. I think that's about done. Set this down. How's that cake coming along? It's good. Yeah. I think it it's done? all ready. Yes, I believe so. Yep. Okay. Good job. Let me go get our caramel pan. Okay. Our caramel has started to harden, but that's normal. So first, you're going to take your cake mix, pour it around. Okay. Pour it around everywhere. Okay. Okay. 
Okie dokie. That's all ready now. Okay. Now for the fun. This part I can't let you do because it's a little tricky. Okay? So watch carefully. So maybe you can help me soon. You're going to pour it in the middle. Right? Like that. Okay? Oops. Yeah, you can't do this fast. Or else. So we're pouring this in the middle. So it can be the flan when we flip it over. It can be on the top. Okay. We're going to pour it in. Almost there. Okay. Yeah. Right? You excited for the taste test? Yes. Okay. Finish pouring it in. Almost there. We're all done. Here's our cake. Okay, so here, once I've finished pouring all my flan in here, I've wrapped tightly, as you can see, the aluminum foil around the bunt. And you can cook this in an oven with a water bath that goes three quarters away up on your pan. Or I also found an easier way where you cook it on the stove top in a pan with water, same three quarters of the way on your pan. You're going to for this one, it should take about 30 minutes, but for a bigger pan, it could take 45 to an hour to cook. Okay, so we're gonna take this, careful. Over here, I have my water. Okay, be very careful. Okay, they're gonna need for a lid for your pan. You're gonna cover it and let it cook. Okay, very easy. Okay, so here we have a choco fl mini choco flan that we have made it in advance because it does need to cool for a few hours before you flip it out and eat it. See so here you can see, and over here we also have some garnishes. Would you like to put the strawberries? Yes. Here we have Godivia uh, milk chocolate truffles that we're also going to garnish it with. Okay, so put a strawberry there, then one here, and then one there. Okay, got it? And I'll, I'll do the chocolates. Okay. Thank you. Okay, scoop this over. Open this one. Come on, chocolate. Okay. Okie dokie. There we go. Throw that in the trash for me since it's behind you. Okay. Now you want to cut a slice? You want to help me cut a slice? Put your hand on me. Cut a chocolate. The chocolate doesn't want to cut. Ooh. You want a piece of strawberry on yours? Yeah. Okay. Cut. Ooh. Look at that. Ooh. Look at that. The flan's on top, you can see. And then here we have our chocolate cake. And we have our caramel on top. Okay, so my taste tester, you ready to taste? Okay, go ahead, take a bite. Okay, you got the. How's it? It's Tell good. us. Good. Good. Mm -hmm. Stealing cake again. <laughs> You're stealing dessert again. Oh my gosh. Mm. <laughs> Is it good? Tell them how it tastes. It tastes really good. Okay. Oh. Hope you enjoyed my video today, and I hope you learned some th a thing or two about how making choco flan. Bye. Hope you enjoyed my video. They're going to say something.